I've seen scripts and seen movies where writers have actually structured their story around stages of grief. So mm -hmm. as a way to take the character through a specific arc, I think that could work very well. But I'm also very curious about these stages of grief. Um, have they changed over the years? Do you believe in them? Do they exist? What are they? <laughs> <laughs> That's a great question because what I've found again in, in doing my, my grief counseling um, and then also my own personal life is that while the stages are helpful in providing some sort of framework uh, for normalcy, it is not linear. Um, and, and every single person in our grief groups, and then of course myself included, and then the authors of this book, um, it's never linear. Um, so 10 years later, you could be listening to a, a, watching a commercial and uh, the jingle comes up and you're thrown into anger at why this had to happen to your loved one who died. Um, there's there's no um, nice, neat, linear way that you can go through the grieving process where you come out at the other end feeling 100% back to normal. Um, in fact, your, your life is never right? normal. What? <laughs> Wait, isn't that last one acceptance, right? Acceptance, <laughs> fine, <laughs> everything's good. Yay, end of movie, right? <laughs> it's, it's not really like that. No, and it's not like that for anyone. And, and, and people are so, get so angry when you hear, oh, well, it's been a year, you should be over it. Or he or she is in a better place. Or um, this was all part of a, a larger plan. Or um, you know, when when our grievers hear that, they want to scream, and they know that people are trying to be helpful, but 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 no, they they don't want to accept, and they don't ever want to accept. In fact, a lot of them like to they want to hang on to that pain so that they have this constant reminder of that they're not going to lose this person. They don't want to lose the memory of this person. They don't want to just go on like nothing has happened. Um, and so you, acceptance is, you never really accept this loss. The loss is, is indelible. It, it never goes away. Um, that person or thing is never coming back. But um, so we like to talk more about how do you move on, not even move on, but how do you honor the loss? It's always going to be with you, but then you can move on and have a meaningful life in other ways.